been a massive character to this to the sport and to all sports really. Like he's a massive idol for for me and a lot of other Irish rugby players. And uh, to see him retire is sad, but he's had a phenomenal career and what he's uh, what he's done and achieved is something that all Irish rugby players should try and aspire to and look up to. Uh, so yes, it is sad, but he's he's a phenomenal player, a phenomenal man. Yeah, like I think it was um, probably a bit of a shock to everyone, but uh, you know, it's it's a guy who's achieved so much in his in his career, and um, you know, if uh, if he feels right in his head, uh, that now's the time, and you know, he's got all the the best advice there to him, and you know, his friends and family and colleagues, and I'm sure he's made the best decision for him, and you know, we can. Um, Keep his head very high. It's an absolutely fantastic career, and um, you know I wish him all the best, and he would be successful, whatever he was on to do. Yeah, personally, he's probably, um, if not the greatest, he's close enough to it that I've ever worked with. He's just an icon. He's a man of great substance, and uh, when he when he spoke, um, yeah, it was imposing. It was compelling. Um, when he stood in the room or in the dressing room with the players around him. It was a force of force of nature, a man that could that could you know gel uh, an energy within a group of people and, and make things happen.